R&B singer James Ingram has died. He was 66. I'm John Bowden from Rock History Music. Here we go again, another huge loss in music. Considering when you look at all the hits James Ingram had, and look at all of them, they're all still being played on radio today. They certainly have stood the test of time. His first two hits came from Quincy Jones' album, The Dude, from 1981, Just Once and 100 Ways. The following year, he scored his first of two number one hits with Baby Come To Me, a duet with Patty Austin. A few months later came another duet hit with Michael McDonald and Yamo Be There. There was also a pairing with Kim Carnes and Kenny Rogers on What About Me in 84, and one of his biggest hits in 1986, a duet with Linda Ronstadt, Somewhere Out There. It was from the animated film An American Tale. And that second number one hit for him was actually his last hit on the charts. It came out in 1990, and we all remember I Don't Have the Heart. Ingram was nominated multiple times for a Grammy, and he won two for Best R&B Performance for 100 Ways and Best R&B Performance by a Duo or Group with Vocals for Yamo Be There, also featuring Michael McDonald. Through his association with Quincy Jones, he got to write PYT, Pretty Young Thing, from Thriller and Michael Jackson. He also co-wrote with Jones with the song The Secret Garden, which also featured Barry White, Elle DeBarge, and Al B. Shure. Debbie Allen was a longtime friend and collaborator, and she wrote the following on Twitter today. He will always be cherished, loved, and remembered for his genius, his love of family, and his humanity. I am pleased to have been so close. We will forever speak his name. He was born in Akron, Ohio, but wanted to get into music and moved to L.A. At one point, he was actually Ray Charles' piano player just before he became famous himself. He will be missed, one of the good ones. Make sure you comment on our channel. Comment on this video if you have memories about James Ingram. Maybe you met him, you saw him in concert, you bought his albums. Share our videos and make sure you subscribe to our channel. That's important. I'm John Bowden from Rock History Music. Mm -hmm.